So quickly, the last thing I want to do, I want to show you how to create these mountains if you have tilt sensitivity on your tablet. So you don't have to use those four and six key to rotate your canvas. I'm going to get rid of these mountains. I'm going to create a new mountain layer here. Let's call more mountains. And I made a lot of mountains. I'm actually just going to rename this one A because that was my favorite. I don't know, maybe I'll beat it with this one. Okay, so the only thing we're going to do here is for our palette knife, I'm going to go to the brush engine and I'm just going to turn on rotation. And by default it should have this tilt direction because that's what it had before. And I'm going to leave that. So what that means is now when I'm drawing I can turn my hand and the direction of the palette knife will change. The angle of the knife. Now if I'm doing this I'm also going to want to change the default angle because I'm just holding my hand in a natural position here and it's 90 degrees off of where I want it when I'm holding in my natural position. So let's go back to our mountain mixture here. Okay, that's not what I want. So I'm going to go to the brush tip area and I'm going to change the angle to looking here, change it to that's that's looking like what I want. It doesn't look like it looks here because I might have the pen rotated in my hand differently. It's fine. I'm just looking for something that'll... Yeah, that'll go good. Okay. So now I'm drawing... I'm going to draw my mountain something like this, right? But if I want to change it later, I can just rotate my hand and then I can get it to turn this way instead of rotating the canvas. So let's do that. Let's create a mountain. Now the snow part is where this really comes in handy. So let's go to my snow brush because now I can angle this how I want. Except, of course, I need to turn that on my snow brush too. So let's turn on rotation, tilt, rotation, good. Change that angle to something up here. That looks good. Choose titanium white. I'm going to zoom in a bit here. And yeah, this is where it becomes way nicer. Now I can change this angle as I go. In the back side of the mountain, I can choose my mixed blue there, light blue, reduce my brush size slightly, and now I can just tilt my pen to give me the, the angle I want. Remember, there are no mistakes because in digital painting we have Control Z, undo. There we go. I'm going to smudge this down a bit, the bottom. Like Bobby says, the lower we get, the less detail the detail there should be. There we go, look at that, another mountain. How's that compared to my favorite one? Hmm, not bad. I think I like this one better still. That one was created without the tilt. Maybe it wasn't, I can't remember. Now because we didn't save that brush, next time I switch or choose, my palette knife, the rotation is going to be off. And now I'm stuck in one fixed position again. So if you do have tilt sensitivity, when you change those settings, turn on rotation, adjust the drawing angle to fit, the, to fit how you hold your pen, and make sure you overwrite it to save it. And before you overwrite, always get your icon back. Thanks for joining me, and I hope to see you back for the next show.